Hey everybody, it's Lex from PDQ.com. You know, uh, I love Deploy. I love using Deploy to get software out there. Um, you know, eventually you get to a point where you need to uninstall software. And I'm gonna show you the best way to do that. Now, uh, we do have uninstall packages in the package library. You can go and look up uninstall and you're gonna find we've got a ton of uninstall packages out there, but there's going to come a time where you've got software that you need to find the uninstall string and that's where inventory comes into play. I know a lot of people are like, well, you know, I just need deploy, I don't need inventory. Inventory provides you a better insight and more data into your network as in regards to reports and that. So let me just show you a quick way. Again, you can go look for this in the registry and there's like three or four different places in the registry you could find the uninstall string or you can go and, you know, right click, but let's make this really easy. I'm gonna open the machine Allen Rails and I'm gonna to go to applications. And you'll notice I've got this uh, QGIS Bon on here. And if I scroll to the right, check it out. We already grab the uninstall string for you. And the great thing about that is all I have to do at this point is right click, hit uninstall, and it's gonna pop open a remote command window so that I can uninstall from that machine. Now, this is an EXE and you need to have silent parameters in regards to that. So all you gotta do is Google and I did this silently uninstall QGRS. There we go, check it out. This is from them directly. It says front slash capital S. Again, I'm gonna mimic exactly what they said. So I'm gonna put a front slash capital S on here and then I can execute this. And what it's going to do is it's gonna connect to this machine. In this case, it's Allen Rails and it's gonna uninstall that software. I didn't have, there it is. Look at that return code zero means it's success. I didn't have to go search for that. I didn't have to, you know, uh, cruise through the registry and I didn't have to go to the person's machine specifically to do it. So this is a, one of the great things that you can use inventory to do to make your life simpler. So anywho, uh, thanks for watching. I'm Lex from PDQ.com.